Hi there, welcome back to Rab's uh, book uh, tips. Uh, now, don't you hate it when you buy a book um, and it's a book you've always wanted and it's nice condition, it looks appears to be nice, but you, you smell it and it's like, oh, it's all fusty, it's like it smells of cigar smoke or just something very unpleasant sitting in an old fusty house. Well, there's many ways to get rid of that. Some people <laughs> put it in trays of cat litter um, to absorb all the the odours. Um, some people put it in a box of scrunched up newspaper, leave that for a few days and apparently the paper absorbs all the odours as well. But I'm going to show you a very quick way of doing it. Um, now what to do is remove the jacket. You can do the jacket separately, but we'll remove that. The book's the main problem. I mean it's really sort of quite smelly. So, what you need is basically a bag, just a normal plastic bag. And what you do is you just open the book, flat in the bag, being very careful, like this. So your book's open inside the bag. And what you do is, I, I tend to use Gillette, but you can use any, any other sort of deodorant, just simple spray, and just straight into the bag. Oh, that's quite strong. And just all into the bag like that. Um, now, oh. <coughs> right, this as well, hand wash, just simple hand wash. You don't need a lot of it, but I put in about two or three squirts. Don't worry about it getting over the book, because in my next tutorial I'm going to show you how to clean that off. Put it in the bag, it's still sharp. I uh, use a capo for playing with using for pitching a guitar. I'm using a capo to to hold the, the top of the bag, right? Securely. Remember you've got hand wash and deodorant in there. Shake it up a bit. Right, so I want to violently work the the nice odors in and they'll pack up the old odors. Right. And it's literally this quick. Take that out. Watch this. Okay, it's got as I say it's got the hand wash all over it. But um and it's kind of foamed up a bit, but I wouldn't worry about that too much because as I said, show you to clean up and it's kind of got into the page edges and stuff. But if you smell that it have a, oh no, you can't actually smell but that smells much better. So what we do is we get the jacket, just put it back in. This isn't one of my rare books because I've already done that to all my, my rare books and they all smell really nice now. So anyway, so there you have it. A quick way on how to um, uh, clean your books. Simple as that. Um, tune in for more hot tips on how to take care of your books. I'll be doing a, a sec, uh, section soon on shelving your books and a system to, you know, there's a lot of problems with different sizes and um, different parts of your collection belonging to different parts. So I'm going to show you a, a really good way of storing books next time. Thanks for tuning in.